Hello guys and welcome to a brand new video. Today I'm here with Tower of God, episode number 8. Uh, in the previous episode we got a few information about uh, quite a few things. For example, like uh, we got to know that uh, the princesses of Jahaz are not permitted to have children because of that uh, inheritance of power thing. And uh, also it might be the thing like uh, her mother, like Anak's mother was killed because the people found out that she has violated the rule a few things like these and uh, at the end we kind of got to a portion where like they had to face a trial uh, by like two teams they were divided into two teams and uh, the person who was like taking their test was uh, quite strong and like we can see that he is going to be a problem and Kuhn kind of like tried to counteract uh, that guy's strategy but uh, at the end we kind of got to see like uh, he kind of exceeded Kuhn's expectations but but I think like Kuhn has a counter plan for that as well and this is just my guess let's see what happens in this episode because Kuhn is too uh, what do you call it too intelligent like uh, he definitely has a plan and I think so that he has a plan so let's see what happens in this episode. Okay, so I'll be putting the timer and the subtitles here. Sync it to which as a preference. Let's get started. Okay, I'll be starting the countdown. Three, two, one, go. This is episode number eight. Um, so I think like there will be uh, nine, ten, eleven, three or four more episodes. I don't know if this is like eleven episodes or twelve episodes. I don't know. Uh, like it will be something like that. And uh, like I'm thinking like after this ends, which anime should I react to? Like I'll be reacting to uh, an anime which was like uh, in the previous. Uh, what is what is this? This is summer 2020, isn't it? Yeah. So I'm probably going to like react to something from summer 2020 which ended that I can kind of like do uh, every week one episode. So I'm thinking which I should do. Like I have kind of like a few options here and there. Uh, I don't know. I'll probably figure that out later on. Like this Tower of God was from the... Um, Spring 2020 so I kind of did it in that summer 2020 uh, and after summer 2020 ends I'll like uh, like pick some one of the animes from it and do it like every week nah, yeah this guy hot headed yep Okay, let's see if this like Shinsu Quant. Okay. Oh no, he's pissed. Yes. <laughs> yeah, I think Kuhn has something up his sleeves. Um, one, one, one. Okay. Yeah, definitely. Oh no. Um, no one's here, so you should probably stop. Hmm. Yeah, exactly. That's what I was saying. Like, Kun is extremely intelligent.
<laughs> okay, he has that smile. <laughs> Alright. Um, yeah, I, I can see that. You're one of them. My god. <laughs> he himself knows that it's me, uh, Rahel. Hmm. Those two. Okay, there's another. Okay. They has like, they definitely have some plan. Yeah, like hundred and ten and hundred and eleven. Like is it going to like oh my god, here it is. Okay, he, he just... Yeah. Five minutes. Okay. Okay, he he is pretty fast. So, oh no, he he's walking. Okay, I'm listening. Oh. Hmm, let's see if I can answer. Um, I don't know, like... Oh my god! Okay, this guy is fast, like... Um, those things can hit him. Okay. Um, you're one of them. What the hell are you saying? Like you're too confident. Okay, he is heavily underestimating them and I think that will come and bite him in his ass. I really want that. <laughs> oh yeah. Hmm. Okay. Um <laughs> Oh 
okay so yeah he is like getting up yes definitely <laughs> okay so this epic fight wait they're doing choco bar fights Okay, let's see. I really want them to win, like um Kuhn to win. Okay. <laughs> yeah, like he is like two steps ahead. Okay. Oh, he can like uh, duplicate the people, can he? I, I don't know, I, I'm thinking. Can he do duplicate the people? Like if he duplicates the it. So even if he is catched, caught. Even if Anak is caught, he, he is not a real one. Okay, is it behind him? <laughs> Little redhead. <laughs> um, oh my god. <laughs> this guy. This guy is amazing. Oh my god. This guy's too overconfident, like he needs a wake up call. <laughs> yeah. <coughs> I think he duplicated, didn't he? Or no, no. Oh, okay. Okay. Is it tricking him? Like. He's tricking him. I, I I can feel it. Like he's tricking him, or not? I don't know. Ah, oh. uh, my. Okay. What? He's rallying him up. <laughs> A lighthouse. Okay. Okay, he's quite smart. <laughs> oh no. Okay. Okay, let's see. What's he doing? 
Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> Amazing! This was a great uh, plan. Okay, okay. He kind of used it as a pulley. Damn, that was that was okay, okay. God damn, that was an amazing plan. Oh, okay, he is kind of cheering for the enemy team. Uh, well. Okay, like... <laughs> what the hell? What is happening? Wait, what? Wait. Wait. Like, why did he do that? What? What the hell? Like, no, 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 what the hell happened? God damn, that is like, after such an amazing, like, strategy. Yeah, like, why did it help him? Wait, what? What is happening here? My god, the planning in this... What? No, he wants... Okay, he wants uh, Yoru to win. Is, is that the reason why? Oh god! <laughs> Oh my god, this was amazing. Like, okay, okay, okay. Hats off to this guy. Like, oh. Okay. Man, that was amazing. Scout's assignment. Wait, wait, what? 
I have to I have to watch this again like later on. <laughs> and as always, endorsey. Evolution. <laughs> yeah. Shut up. Mm. Oh my god, this guy's freaking out. Cat burglar. Surrender of Nishi. Oh, my God. Head on, okay. Oh God, this guy. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. Well. Okay, so. Okay, I have to watch that portion again, like, kind of like. Like so, what did the hell happen? Like, uh, as far I go, as I got is like, Kuhn's real uh, task was to make his real team. That is, that he may made with that uh, kind of like nine members uh, to make it the real team. Win by disguising it as if they lost. Well, like, was it something like that? I'm going to like I'm going to watch that portion again like a little bit whatever that was that was amazing like there were layers upon layer okay like I'm really impressed by this episode that was some like uh, what can I say that was some real like planning
I kind of get excited in this type of planning and strategies. <laughs> okay. Like I'll I'll have to watch that portion again. Is that the end? Yeah, it's the end. Okay, let me just like skim through that portion. Uh Achieve's victory is truly bitter. He didn't betray his team. Okay, uh let's see. Uh the friend list. Uh should be suit uh twenty fifth bomb. Okay, it 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 is your heart schoon Laure Hope Serena Linen Rock and OC Okay make ten friends within one week like okay so Sika Lauri Linen Rock and OC Shibisu Uh Where is Anak I can't see Anak's name didn't Anak also signed it, didn't she? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I think the number tenth one is like Anak. Like there are nine names I can see. Anyways, okay, so like Anak must be there. Like she also signed it. Okay, so this is Kun's real team. The scouts assignment. Team A had to lose while leaving as many hints as possible for team b okay so like you have to like keep hints for team b okay okay and uh, he carefully chose what he need to bring to the tower in order for these 10 to pass the test okay Kun, Anak, Shibisu and Laure are currently guaranteed to pass. Okay. Kun, Anak, Shibisu and Laure. Okay. But. I doubt that Edit will grant Kun's wish so easily. So like. So like he kind of like made a deal or something with him. Like. Uh. Okay, so like they're like guaranteed to uh, qualify. Like the main thing here is like those tend to pass. I can't say guaranteed to pass. Okay, so like uh, did he like uh? Okay, so here's the thing like. He like his mission was to make his team win. That is number of uh, the, the the teams that he selected. The ten of the ten guys, and like like if he wins, his team wins. So that kind of uh, like you can't make the other team win. So he kind of made this strategy where he will uh, like they were like guaranteed to win um, because of their points. I think I don't know. Anyways, and uh, so he kind of made a plan. So that he kept hints for team number B and like made a deal with the um, what was it uh, made a deal with uh, the ranker and uh, so that they could pass the selected few could pass and uh, making the uh, team A will also pass so like their whole team will pass so that's the thing okay so like I think like the ranker kind of uh, gave in to his demands because he did not want to lose the match is that the reason why because like they gave him a chance to like win the match so yeah i don't know what deal he made uh if that deal was like uh, make uh, the selected few of us win from our team if that was the deal i don't know anyways so yeah okay so that was a really like what do you call it witty thing he did okay so um, okay now let's talk about this episode I'll come to that portion again uh, while discussing this episode and okay if at first we see like the ranker coming and like being unable to like what do you say like he kind of like gave them a chance to go away because obviously because of his pride and everything and his overconfidence and uh, he was really like underestimating these guys 
and like he is pretty strong and uh, quite uh, intelligent as well but that does not give you the like uh, that doesn't make you what do you call it like th that should not mean that yeah i should like underestimate them underestimating the enemy is like the worst thing you should do and like everyone was like kind of uh, guessing that yeah the, the ranker will win and here we can see like Endorsi and uh, Yoru talking about uh, a few things and uh, obviously we can we can see like Yoru knows that that is Rahel uh, not some Michel Light or anyone else like he knows and it's just like doing it for the sake like calling her Michelle just for the sake of it and uh, so that like uh, no more like like no problems kind of arise and uh, Here is like the whole thing like uh, what was his name Ho no was his name Ho the guy who is sleeping no I don't know I, I'm, I'm like uh, mixing up the names anyways the guy who sleeps uh, he kind of like uh, was sleeping because of that reason like that was part of the plan like so that he can come later on when the plan is in motion so he was sleeping and uh, they were like kind of trying to stall him but obviously he's too powerful and unable to do it and uh, then we see like where is it yeah then we see like um, the ranker catching up to them caught up to them and then uh, Kuhn is standing and at first I thought that uh, Kuhn like can replicate things so he like he must have used that for something but uh, actually no he did not do that he just like uh, like that was a really great plan he like put layers upon layer of this of deception he put a layer of deception on top of another one like that was some real great planning so the basically the thing he did was at his first plan was to kind of like uh, make the uh like what do you call it make the ranker understand his plan like portion of his plan portion of his plan was that yeah i'm going to let uh, anak go down with that lighthouse thing uh, and i'm going to like tr try to like uh, rile up the rank ranker and the ranker would obviously be able to uh, sense uh anak because of that shinsu power thing of him of his uh, he can easily sense it so he like kind of like played the fool himself, played the part of the fool himself and uh, sounded overconfident so that the uh, ranker slips up and thinks that yeah he's trying to trick me without knowing that the trick is layered upon like underneath another trick. So he like he thought that yeah this guy is too cocky so like I'll try to uh, like uh, I'll tell him that yeah I know your plan and then like he decided to like jump down. So he did that and the funny thing is here is like like th that was like a deception underneath another deception which was like uh, which was this that he had a plan to like uh, what do you call it uh, let go of the rancor and Anak would help him with her, so uh, her weapon and they would like make a pulley system so that he comes down and Anak goes up and th that was supposed to be the main plan which was not which was also layered upon with another deception layer now after anak went up and she ran towards uh, the ending like the exit the ranker guy was down and that would have been the end of it now i i like i got really surprised that like the sleeping guy came and i thought that he was betraying them but no, that was another deception. My god, this episode was like so good in department of this planning thing. And like, like there were like one, two, three, three layers of deception. Like what the hell? And like then the main thing came into play that the main thing was that yeah, I like Kuhn did not, doesn't give a damn about his whole team. He just gives a damn about the 10 members that his uh, like internal team that he chose so like i think like at that moment he kind of struck the deal like uh, he was like sure like he was like it was 
obviously like ev evidence seeing that yeah there are two teams and they're like divided into like unequal uh, the team were divided so like if one team wins another would obviously lose so he like struck this deal with him so that the few uh, a few kind of like uh, teammates of his would win and Yoru's whole team will win making it like a full team and his full team can win at that same time so that is the way he did it okay and after that his main uh, plan came into motion and he helped him go up in like uh, by like what do you call it in return he would I think he would like ask the ranker to like make them pass or something like that I don't know or it might be something else like this guy is full of plans and I might be like uh, like he might have some other plan as well I don't know anyways so yeah that was like oh my god that was just so good ah like I was really impressed by this and uh, like I was expecting some kind of deception some kind of like intelligent thing happening but not at this level like this was like like layer upon layer and oh my god that was so good oh like this is one of the best episodes i i, I don't give a damn uh, about like i i know some there are a few more episodes others left as well but like through planning and plotting kind of perspective this was like at the top like this is at the top and looking at Kun, I, I don't think like this is his full power as well, like his brain power. <laughs> he is like so, what do you call it? Uh, so intelligent and everything. And his plan and everything is like. And, and at the end we see like Endorsi kind of like uh, getting ready with the other team members so that he, she can stop uh, the rancor. And yeah, that was the episode. I got them. I was not expecting that. I was expecting uh, like a little, some portion of it, but in the scale that it happened, the way they presented it and everything, like so good. Like it was really amazing. Okay, so that was this episode, guys. If you guys enjoyed my reaction, press the like button. Subscribe if you are new to the channel or you haven't and uh, be sure to comment down below your opinions about this episode i i really love this episode and i don't know if like something um, uh, like uh, there are uh, like i think three or four more episodes left i don't know if something as good as this comes in the upcoming episode i don't know but like this was just so amazing and yeah okay so yeah i'll be back with another tower of god episode next week and uh, so yeah thank you guys for watching again until then goodbye and have a nice day